Let's review the Kickstarter update. Hi everyone, this is Hayne from Wizards Den and you are watching Sorcery TCG News. Today we are going to talk about the Kickstarter update that Eric Curiosa gave us recently. Here are the topics that I'll be covering. So let's get on it. Let's start from the production status update. It looks like all printing and cutting process is finished and 48% of booster packs were sealed. Last week, Eric updated that 33% of the boosters were packed. So it looks like around 15% progress per week maybe? I think two or three more weeks for all package process to finish I guess? Well, let's hope for the best. Also, it looks like booster boxes will have a scratch-free lamination, which is new information. Nice finishing touch. The update also mentioned that there are internal dividers for booster packs, but that was already known in the past. Next, let's talk about the box stoppers. In the video clip that was attached to the update, there was a first time reveal of the actual booster box stopper. Up till now, the box toppers were to have four cards in it. Foil Sorcerer, Foil Wind River, Critical Strike, and Syrian Templar. However, the video revealed that there would be an addition of two more cards. A rubble token and a card with all the artist's name on it. I guess I'll call it the artist card. I certainly love the inclusion of rubble tokens as those might get in handy. Now the foils. Isn't that good looking? Check out the masking on the main illustration and also the cold foiling around the text box and the title. Like, uh, I like how the mana cost and the elemental threshold got a foiling too. And you know, last but not least, the full art back is just awesome. Just can't wait to get my foil gray wolves. The update also mentioned about the precons and gave this image, but we sort of already know this info from the small update that Eric gave two weeks ago. So up till now, I was just going over the update itself. But from here, I'll be dealing some spoiler information I got from the video post and Eric's comments on the Discord. If you look closely at the video, you will notice that there were glimpses of images of unrevealed cards in Curiosa.io. Yes, these were part of the missing 35 cards that I was talking about in the Alpha Spoiler Card List episode. If you haven't watched that episode, I'll put a link, so please check it out. From the Kickstarter video, there were 6 cards from the missing 35 card list being confirmed to be included in Alpha. It looks like my guess regarding these cards being included in Alpha was in fact correct. The revealed cards are listed here. I would like to highlight a critical card which is regarding number 293. The card image is this which is predestination. Now the name is different and funny enough Eric accidentally wink mentioned the new name later censoring it as shown in the discord comment. I was actually there when he leaked the name and caught it firsthand. The new name for the predestination card is Kithera Mechanism an artifact card. The new name perfectly fits the name range hypothesized in my previous video and I am confident that most of the cards I presented in the card list hypothesis episode would likely be correct. Finally, there were information about Gen Con. It was revealed by the company that they will be hosting events on Gen Con which takes place in Indianapolis from August 3rd to the 6th. The main event is the Crown of Victor Championship which the top prize will be the original art of Crown of the Victor. There would also be other events and it would certainly be a good time for sorcery players to meet up. Now I would like to make one note. Finding a hotel is difficult. In fact so difficult that I was not able to book a hotel on the first day that the housing reservation started. I got a room now, 
but I would bet that it will be really difficult if you wait too long. Plan ahead and make your reservations early. And because I got a room, yes, I will be going to Jankon, all the way from Japan. I'm really excited meeting all the sorcery fans and have a good time playing with actual cards. I bet there will be some meetup plans in the official Discord, so let's not miss out on this. Are you guys going to Gen Con? Thoughts on the Kickstarter updates? Let me know in the comments section. So that's it for today's Sorcery TCG news. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for future episodes regarding sorcery. Thanks for watching and until next time, have a great day.